Aye, let's from retired and living the dream. Today's video is going to be about escaping the credit crunch. Ways and means of how you can escape the credit crunch in retired life. I know, I've done it, I've made the jump, I've escaped the credit crunch and I'm living a better life on half the amount of money that I used to earn in the UK. So I'm going to give you some examples on how you can do this. And we're going to start off with this, this house here. This is the first house that I ever bought when I was 22 years old and I bought it and it was £14,000. That was the maximum I could borrow on the salary that I was earning as a firefighter. So this was my first house and now, and now a similar house to this, which is only a few doors away from where I used to live, went up for sale in 2021 for 74, nearly £75,000. So let's just say £74,000. I'm going to put some costs up there for euros, US dollars, etc, etc. So you can get an example as to actually what money can buy elsewhere around the world. And as I said, to live in this house, I'd have to pay council tax. Now council tax, here's a list of council tax. Now I'm in the band where I'd have to pay at least £180 a month. Now this council tax band for even not living at that house, I'd have to pay roughly £180 a month, whether I live there or whether I don't. So fancy having to pay £180 council tax whether you live there or whether you don't. Now the average electricity bill in the UK, up until April, because the cap's been removed, so up until April is an average of £2,500 per year. So just for your electricity bill and council tax, you could live in this house here. This is the house that I live in, and it would cost you less than your electricity bill and council tax to live in this house here. So the first house I ever bought is roughly worth about £74,000 now. So you can buy this in Thailand for £74,000. Now watch the video and you'll see what my life is, is like in Thailand. I've done some videos of my little life in Thailand. So anybody can live this lifestyle. You just have to make the move and make the jump and actually live a better life for half the amount of money that you used to live on in your home country. I've lived in Thailand now for over 10 years and I've loved every single minute of it. Here we are in October and it's still lovely. I'm still in a t-shirt, I can sit outside here on the sofa on our veranda and it's warm all year round. It's beautiful living here. So why be stuck in the freezing cold? October now, nights are, are drawing in, it's getting colder and colder and you're gonna be stuck in the house all the time. Like me living here in Thailand, you can sit outside all day, it's beautiful. So watch the video, leave your comments. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you don't like the video, give it a thumbs down. Subscribe to my channel, be very, very nice. So thanks for watching again and enjoy the video. Mm -hmm.